India's longest bowstring arch bridge, Mumbai Coastal Road and Bandra Whirly Sea-Link Connector. The integration of Mumbai's Coastal Road and Bandra Whirly Sea-Link, BWSL, is an important infrastructural project aimed at enhancing connectivity and easing traffic congestion in the city. The Brihanbai Municipal Corporation, BMC, and the Hindustan Construction Company which undertook this project, as per recent news reports, achieved a significant milestone in Mumbai's infrastructure development by successfully installing a massive 2,000 metric ton arch bridge connecting the Chhatrapati Sambhaji Maharaj Coastal Road, also known as the Mumbai Coastal Road, and the Bandra Whirly Sea Link, BWSL. This analytical report aims to provide an in-depth analysis of this engineering feat, including the technical details, the chronology of events, historical context, challenges faced during the installation process and the importance of this project in Mumbai's infrastructure development. For those interested in knowing more about the Mumbai Coastal Road Project, kindly view an earlier video whose links are available in the i icon at the top right-hand corner of your screen or through the playlist of videos found at the end of this video. Details for this video has been gathered from various news reports of April 27, 2024, April 26, 2024 and March 7, 2024. Hi friend! Welcome back to SciTech Buzz One channel. We wish to sincerely thank all the new subscribers of this channel. We have observed that 97% of our viewers haven't subscribed to our channel. If you haven't as yet subscribed, kindly consider doing so, after watching this video, since it would encourage us to do more. Watch this interesting video until the end so that you will not miss out on all the details. Historical Context Bandra Whirly Sea Link, BWSL The Bandra Whirly Sea Link, inaugurated in 2009, is a cable stayed bridge connecting Bandra and Whirly. It is one of Mumbai's most iconic landmarks and a vital transportation corridor, significantly reducing travel time between Bandra and Whirly. The bridge spans the Arabian Sea and is an essential link between the western suburbs and South Mumbai. Mumbai Coastal Road, MCR The Mumbai Coastal Road, also known as the Chhatrapati Sambhaji Maharaj Coastal Road, is an ambitious project aimed at decongesting Mumbai's traffic by providing an alternative coastal route. The project, spanning 10.5 kilometers, aims to connect marine lines in South Mumbai to Kandivali in the northern suburbs. The Coastal Road Project was proposed to ease traffic congestion along the Western Express Highway, providing a faster route for commuters traveling between the northern and southern parts of the city. Project Overview The Coastal Road and BWSL integration project involves the construction of a bridge to connect the two major transportation arteries. The bridge, spanning 850 meters, will comprise both steel and concrete components, with approximately 270 meters constructed from steel. The general manager of planning at Hindustan Construction Company, in an interview with ANI Channel, highlighted the company's involvement in constructing iconic infrastructure in Mumbai, such as the Bandra Whirly Sea Link in 2009 and 2010. The company is proud to have constructed another iconic bridge for the coastal road, adjacent to the Bandra Whirly Sea Link, which is changing the aesthetics of Mumbai and the Whirly Sea Face. The Coastal Road project began in 2018 but faced delays due to litigation cases and PLs in court. Clearance for the construction of the Coastal Road was finally obtained in December 2019. However, construction was further delayed due to resistance from the fishermen community. After discussions and the formation of a committee, it was decided in November 2022 to provide a 120-meter span for the fishermen. This decision created a tight construction window of one to one and a half years for the massive bridge. The government requested different options for the bridge design, including cable stay bridge, cable suspension bridge, bow arch bridge, and OST deck. After evaluating these options, the bow arch bridge was chosen for its aesthetic appeal and cost effectiveness. Technical details of the arch bridge. The newly installed arch bridge is a critical component of the Mumbai Coastal Road project. It is designed to connect the Chhatrapati Sambhaji Maharaj Coastal Road with the Bandra Whirly Sea Link, providing seamless connectivity between the two vital transportation corridors. The technical specifications of the girder are as follows. 
The arch bridge is 2,000 metric tons and 850 meters long, with 4 plus 4 plus 3 lane 2 sections. It consists of a 136 meter long giant bow arch string girder. The girder is 18 to 21 meters wide. Each arm of the bridge will have four girders, with a total of eight girders being used to bridge the gap. The girders are 120 meters in length and will be structurally stabilized with a bowstring arch. Fabrication of steel girders is being done at JNPT, Raigad, and Umbala, with transportation for assembly done on site. Chronology of events Manufacturing and transportation The manufacturing of the girder began in October with prefabricated parts produced in Ambala, Haryana. Approximately 500 trailers were used to transport the components to Mazgan Dock. The girder was assembled at Nhava port in Navi Mumbai before being transported to Worli. Installation process The installation of the girder involved an innovative technique using tidal waves to address the challenging aspect of connecting the Mumbai Coastal Road and the Bandra Worli Sea Link. The installation process commenced at 2 a.m. on Friday, April 26, and concluded successfully by 3.25 a.m. The installation process was as follows. The girder was transported on a barge from Mazgan Dock on April 24 and arrived in Worli on April 25. Engineers demonstrated their expertise by gauging sea waves and wind speed to position the platform securely for installation. The girder was carefully maneuvered between the Mumbai Coastal Road and Bandra Worli Sea Link routes. The girder was gradually brought to the midpoint between the Coastal Road and the Sea Link using a barge. Engineers stabilized the barge amid anticipated sea waves and wind speeds, ensuring optimal conditions for the setup. Two mating cones and units each have been installed on both the Worli side of the Coastal Road and the Sea Link. Each mating unit has a diameter of 2 meters, while the mating cones measure 1.8 meters in diameter. Four mating units were established, with two located on the coastal road and two on the sea link. At these units, the white mating angles on all four corners of the girder were precisely installed by 3.25 a.m. Once all four mating cones and units were aligned, the officers, engineers and workers present signaled that the mission was successful. Advanced welding technology and anti-corrosive C5 Japanese technology were utilized to ensure the seamless joining of spare parts and the longevity of the structure. The girder connects the southbound lanes of the Mumbai Coastal Road to the Bandra Worli Sea Link. Another 143-meter-long girder of 2,400 metric tons is planned to connect the northbound lanes, with installation scheduled for May end. Challenges and Solutions Technical Challenges The installation of a 2,000 metric ton girder in the open sea posed significant technical challenges. The launch of the girder took place in the waters due to insufficient land space at the launch site. Maneuvering the girder and ensuring its secure installation required innovative solutions and meticulous planning. The girder installation was a challenging task due to shallow waters, shifting conditions, and the presence of undersea rocks. Engineers had to carefully gauge sea waves and wind speed to ensure the safe installation of the girder. The installation of the bowstring arch girder was postponed for a week due to unsuitable climatic conditions, including a heat wave in Mumbai. Innovative Solutions An innovative technique using tidal waves was employed to address the challenges of connecting the two routes. Advanced welding technology and anti-corrosive C5 Japanese technology were utilized to ensure the seamless joining of spare parts and the longevity of the structure. Regarding the materials used in the bridge, it is a steel deck bridge. Given the highly corrosive environment of the Worli coast, the company had two choices, using stainless steel or implementing a corrosion protection system for the steel. Stainless steel was considered costly, so the Hindustan Construction Company opted for a painting system, similar to the one established in Japan. The chosen system, known as the C5 system, involves applying a 595 micron paint in five different layers, one of which includes glass flakes. The presence of glass flakes reduces corrosion activity in steel. The lifespan of this paint system is expected to be a minimum of 15 years, up to 25 years, 
based on the experience in Japan. The company anticipates that the bridge will require minimal maintenance for at least 20 to 25 years. Remaining work for next phase. The next phase of the coastal road project involves cement concretization of the girder, using advanced anti-corrosive technology. Jacks will be installed on all four corners along with the mating cones and units. Subsequently, the mating cones and units will be removed after the jacks are activated. The next technical step will involve settling the girder with the assistance of bearings, following which the jacks will be removed. In the upcoming phase of the project, concretization will be carried out spanning between the whirly end of the coastal road and the sea link. The installation of the second girder to connect the northbound lanes is scheduled for May end. Impact on Mumbai's Infrastructure Once completed, the arch bridge will be India's longest, spanning the open sea and connecting two vital transportation corridors. The completion of this project will significantly ease traffic congestion in Mumbai and improve connectivity between the city's northern and southern suburbs. Additionally, the project will benefit the local economy by providing better access to businesses and reducing travel time for commuters. Conclusion The successful installation of the 2000 metric ton arch bridge connecting the Mumbai Coastal Road and the Bandra Whirly Sea Link marks a significant milestone in Mumbai's infrastructure development. This engineering feat demonstrates the BMC's commitment to improving the city's transportation infrastructure and will have a lasting impact on easing traffic congestion and improving connectivity in Mumbai. Despite facing various challenges, including adverse weather conditions and complex construction constraints, the project is progressing steadily. The innovative techniques and advanced technology used in the construction of the bridge set a benchmark for future infrastructure projects in India. Once completed, the bridge will significantly improve transportation efficiency and contribute to the development of Mumbai's infrastructure as the city takes another step towards becoming a more efficient and accessible metropolis. Stay tuned for further developments on these projects. Do let us know your thoughts on the subject in the comments section. My friend, if you have found any value in this video, then kindly click on like button as an encouragement to create better quality content. Please share this video amongst your family members, friends, and in your social media network so that this information might benefit others. Don't forget to subscribe to SciTech Buzz One channel so that you will not miss out on any of our forthcoming videos. Thank you.